Well, they are in every zip code, and if you notice more of them, it's because the rat population continues to grow rapidly here in the valley. Now, experts say that rats are usually drawn to places with lots of vegetation, palm trees, fruit trees, and of course, pet waste. 8 News Now reporter Sally Jaramillo is live near Russell and Rainbow, where one family says they've got a lot of damage, all due to rats. Sally? Christiane, this family has been setting multiple traps inside and outside their home, yet due to the severe amount of problems caused by the rat, they are now living in this trailer. Unfortunately, the rats basically hit our territory about 12 to 15 years ago. George Boda with the Las Vegas Pest Control says he has been going after rats for more than 40 years. The rat actually has to go inside and consume the bait. But 40 years ago, that number was nowhere what it is now. The reason for that rat boom, the housing boom. Well, initially, they came in on transports, initially, from other countries, other states. Uh, our population's growing in a valley, so naturally more people are moving in. Boda says roof rats are becoming one of the biggest problems in the valley. My main concern right now is how to figure out from how to keep it from happening again. Homeowner Bob Bicell says the first time he experienced an issue with rats was about three years ago. They chewed up some pipes in the garage a year later in the attic. Then last week, the whole kitchen was flooding in the family room, and we're just sitting up there looking at it, and all of a sudden, it, this whole feeling just comes crashing down. Bizel believes construction has the rodents on the move. We live in the southwest part of town, and there was a lot of empty lots, and things are starting to build again. So I'm sure that's displacing the rats. Unfortunately, in a residential area, the people that feed the dogs on the exterior of the home, naturally, the rats are attracted to the dog food. The swing pools, unfortunately, they get their water source out of there. The people that have uh, fruit trees, unfortunately, compost, bird feeders. Although there is no spray that can get rid of the rats, using the old-fashioned snap trap with peanut butter may help. I've caught many of them that way. And Boda says as the population grows and the desert areas diminish, rats will be living with us. Reporting live, Sally Jaramillo, 8 News Now.